what's up guys and welcome back to the fifth episode of my manager mode with York City. Um, we're still in the transfer window so I still want to bring in a striker but we, but to get money to buy a free transfer to pay the wages for it I'm going to have to sell some players so I'm trying to like load off some players such as um, Liam Henderson and my left back I think his name's Fifield. Is that his name? I, it's hard to pronounce but I don't know. Um, yeah we have we've been struck with quite a few injuries like so far in the in the career which is never good considering i need to play a full season with limited amount of players i can't just go and buy some new ones like mid-season like i would be able to say ultimate team <laughs> so um yeah i think this is the fa cup or the john paints trophy or something like that i was playing against Tramia and I'm not even bothered. That should have been a yellow card for his keeper. He didn't even get anything. I got a, I got a penalty, but he didn't get like anything against him. That should be a yellow card if I would have got one in. I think it was the the match before this one, or the match before. We conceded the penalty anyway, and I got um, a yellow card. But um, Walker steps up and he takes a marvelous penalty. That was a for me. That was just a perfect penalty. Top right corner. Keeper couldn't have done anything about that. Even if he would have dived the right way probably would have not got to it but I've been playing ultimate team quite a bit Um I've built a Brazilvers Brazilvers squad already and it's pretty nice I'm not gonna lie I've got I'm not gonna tell you who I've got because I might do a video on it if you do want to see a video on it please let me know in the in the description not description sorry um, in the comments below and I'll get that sorted like a squad review slash builder slash whatever you want to see Um but we go into half time against Tramia one one nil, and I'm happy with that considering they're a League One side, I think, or a Championship League One. They might be League One. I'm pretty sure the League One. I should know this. But anyway, um, they do make a lot of chances, but it's just <laughs> I had to put this bit in here because look, look at this. He just gets ninja kicked in the head. <laughs> For me, I was sitting there laughing, and if Ryan, if you're watching, that's what I was talking about. He just got Jackie Chan all over the show. But yeah. It was it was brilliant that, um, but like in this game, like I said in like all the other games, we make so many chances, and this is why we need a striker because we cannot finish for shit. Like honestly, we make so many chances, some lovely balls over the top, and I can't finish anything. So it did finish one nil. We did win, so we're through to the next round of John Paints Trophy. Um, but sadly, we didn't win by a large amount, and I've actually sped up all like John like the boring bits, which aren't actual gameplay it's just the um like the i don't know what to call it the manager hub kind of thing where you do all your stuff like transfers and that i've just sped up all this stuff so you can't don't have to watch me um changing some like positions and yeah it, it'd be boring to watch basically but yeah um mass like big hello to all of the new subscribers that have fifa tips hd or alp have brought Alp27 and FIFA Tips are just absolute top lads. They help smaller YouTubers such as myself out so much. All you have to do is be nice and ask them politely, say, could you please check out this video? And that's all it takes. If they enjoy it and they like it, then that'll bring people over. And that, I guess that's what it did, really. And I gained about 20 subscribers just from those two alone. And it doesn't sound like a lot, say, compared to someone with 10,000 subscribers but to someone with just 170 now I think 170 something 20 subscribers is a hell of a lot so I can't thank them enough and a big hello to everyone who has recently subscribed it means so much to me and yeah hello <laughs> um, but yeah we jump into our next game against Port Vale I know for a fact that these are a top um, League 2 side because um they they're always contending for like the top spot. They are they haven't started too well in my season this season. They're in the bottom half of the table, but I know they always finish like in the top half. So I know for a fact we need to be winning this game. But nothing happened in uh, the first half at all. That's why there was just one little tiny clip um, t that I had to edit in. But the second half was a bit more exciting. Like thankfully. We couldn't convert many chances, but there were some lovely balls through. Like I'm, <sighs> I feel like I'm repeating myself a hell of a lot because we just cannot finish for crap. Seriously, we need to bring in some nice Brazilians. Like 
uh, I, I don't want to say the names who I've got in me Brazil vs team because they are absolute beasts but if you do want to see a video on that please let me know and I'll get that sorted but after this game I've not got much clips to show you after this so yeah um, this is the end of the video and hope you enjoyed it if you have please leave a like and I'll see you in the next episode I hope you go come back to watch it and peace